Paul Tisdale, you uh, you said it would be a good measure against uh, how your side have progressed. How do you feel that went today? We've pro definitely progressed, and uh, okay, I feel dis bitterly disappointed that they scored a couple of goals, but. Um, the team applies themselves, I think, extremely well to the things I'd asked them to do. There's certainly one or two things in our play that I'd like to improve on, but in terms of their their, their commitment to the, the themes that we address every game, again, I was as pleased tonight with that as I was on Wednesday night. The difference was, again, we didn't put the ball in the net when we had our chances. Um, goals make a difference. So I, I mean, it's, it's, it's obvious, but uh, we missed a couple of good chances and maybe the best chance of the game. And well, on Wednesday we got away with it because we just we managed to keep the ball out the net and did really well today. We just couldn't quite continue with that. So, a measure of how far we've come. Um, I'm seeing lots of improvement. I think there's some there's some real step forward moments with some of our players in the team, which I'm happy about. Which I think I can build off the back of um, losing two 0 I'm, I'm disappointed, of course I am, but I'm enthused about what I'm seeing, and uh, they really tried hard today. In a way, of shades of Wednesday night, wasn't it? With, with the chances that went begging, and then in the second half, but Forest Green, they're a good side, aren't they? Two two slip ups, maybe, and two goals. Yeah, I, I don't think we're surprised they're a good side. I mean, they're top of the league, so I mean, it sort of, go, sort of goes without saying. So we knew that, you know, against the best teams, you have to you have to optimise your opportunity, and we didn't. And I actually want, I didn't see the first goal because I was making a substitution at that point. Charlie Carter was about to come on. We were about to be more aggressive with our play. Um, but anyway, so I, I actually didn't see the first goal. So disappointed like any manager when you can see the second goal quickly after the first. It, does, it changes the whole complexion of the game. 1 0, you've still got that belief that a minute can change the game. But when you're two down, it, it changes the complexion of it completely. So that's a lesson we have to learn. Um, that even, you know, with. 35 minutes to go, a goal down, you've got to, you've got to re retain your belief and keep playing as you were. But um, again, I, I, I've asked the players themselves in the dressing room, don't, don't, talk, don't talk down what, what we've done. You know, mm. we've, we're disappointed. We know where we have to get better. Um, but I thought we showed some real, again, real discipline and commitment to the team ethic tonight. In front of the goal must be a worry though, Paul. It's what, four, four and a half games now without a goal? Yeah, absolutely. But we've been having chances, mm. so yeah. you know I, I'll, I'll temper that, temper that concern. You've just asked me, am I concerned? Well, of course I'm. I'm a professional person, and I'm concerned Hello. when you don't win games or you don't. But it's not as Hello. deep as you might suggest. We've had really good chances. Mm. We've had, you know, this week four or five extremely good chances, and we're just hoping for the moment when one, one and then two, three go in. But we haven't done that this week. Um, so we just have to we have to believe that it's going to happen for us soon. We're creating the chances. So come on, ne next game, same again, please. I, we we need to we need to retain our 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 purpose and believe that the ball will go in the net. Big worry's got to be Elliot List. How's he? Um, I've not. As you can imagine, I've not had a chance to speak to him. All the physios since we went in, he obviously limped off with a with a very sore hamstring. So we'll keep our fingers crossed not too bad and some work to be done during the course of the week I've been very disappointed if we don't or can't add to our squad soon in the window I mean um, it's, it's a long month mm. you know it's, it is a long month and things can change and January is a very difficult window um, but you know we, we've got we've got uh, with the with the backing of, of Mr Wallace the owner we've got you know really intent to to try to add to the squad and give ourselves a real good building block for the rest of the season which is going to be a very competitive hard working second half of this season but you know I've got you know I'm I, I'm actually enthused by what I've seen this week I really am and, and the Salford game as well so we thought we'd come up we've come away from those three away games with one point and I actually think we could have come come away with four or five points at least so come on let's not let's not talk it down we're on to the next and Let's improve on what we've done, but we're not far away. Thank you, Tom. You're welcome.